I'm Kaylin Tricon, Vice President of Marketing at ChainGuard, where we're focused on securing the software supply chain. ChainGuard hosts the world's most extensive, secure, open source software library, offering thousands of safe image versions across popular projects like Go, Node, Java, and Python. Open source software forms the backbone of modern cloud application development, with 90% of production code being sourced from public repositories. However, many organizations face a precarious situation. Your critical applications depend on an open source security program that's either overstretched, absent, or bogged down managing vulnerabilities. Those vulnerabilities not only consume valuable engineering resources, but pose great risk to your project or business. This is where ChainGuard comes in. ChainGuard images are zero CVE hardened open source container images designed for secure and efficient application development. Updated daily, these images are optimized and seamlessly integrate with your CI CD process. Beyond zero CVEs, each ChainGuard image comes with a signature, attestation, and detailed software bill of materials, or SBOM, at build time, ensuring authenticity and transparency. We also offer FIPS compliant images for federal applications. The best part is, you can get started using ChainGuard images today. We offer the latest version of all ChainGuard developer images for free. Drum roll, please. Starting today, ChainGuard is an official Docker verified publisher, which means you can start pulling all of ChainGuard's developer images on Docker Hub. We can't wait to see everyone in Paris. Stop by booth H28 and say hi, and pick up one of our famous octopus beanies. And remember, ChainGuard is your safe source for open source. Au revoir. Hi, I'm John Jancic from Mirantis. We make and support a full stack of open source based Kubernetes solutions at every scale, from desktops to multi cluster hybrid data centers to edge. Please visit us at booth J27 at KubeCon in Paris where we'll be talking about two very different Kubernetes solutions. For Kubernetes developers, platform engineers, and operators, everybody who uses Kubernetes really, we're demoing and announcing Lens 2024 Early Access. You probably know about Lens. With over a million users, it's the most popular Kubernetes desktop dev and ops environment. Lens 2024 completely reimagines Lens Desktop for a new generation of users who want one Visualize and Act tool to live in, a beautiful, customizable environment that gives you deep focused insight without the noise. Lens 2024 gives you a unified navigator that discovers all your clusters, even clusters on AWS automatically, a tab display, and a new hotbar for saving views like application metrics and logs, and moving between them with single clicks. Time series metrics overlaid with system events for faster troubleshooting and performance optimization. Paid versions of Lens let you add Lens Desktop Kubernetes and a host of services for teamwork, cluster, and resource sharing. We're also introducing a new enterprise subscription tier with advanced services for orgs using Kubernetes at scale. Visit Kate's Lens Dev to try Lens 2024 Early Access for yourself. For system architects and platform engineers, we're demonstrating Cosmetron, a truly disruptive open source operator-based solution for Kubernetes multi-cluster, edge, IoT, and other use cases. Cosmetron lets you create and lifecycle manage hosted Kubernetes control planes on any validated Kate's cluster, public cloud, private cloud, bare metal, and its integrated cluster API operator manages local and remote infrastructure. The result is a fully Kubernetes native, simple, declarative way of provisioning and operating distributed multi-cluster solutions on any combination of infrastructure. Come visit us at Mirantis, booth J27, see demos of Lens 2024 and Cosmetron, and let's talk about how we can make Kubernetes easier for your organization and your projects. Ten minutes. The Syslic Threat Research Team has discovered that on average it takes ten minutes to perpetrate a cloud attack. That means ten minutes to being able to exfiltrate your sensitive data. 10 minutes to start a miner in your infrastructure. Hi, my name is Loris De Giovanni. I'm CTO and founder of Sysdig. Sysdig offers one of the leading CNAP platforms. CNAP stands for Cloud Native Application Protection Platforms. The Sysdig one is unique because we're able to show you today what uh, all of our competitors will show you tomorrow. We do that uh, thanks to a technology called Runtime Insights that allows us to 
capture all of the signals in real time as they come into your infrastructure and, and then allow you to prioritize and to get uh, the best out of vulnerability management, risk, runtime threat detection, forensics, uh, compliance, and so on and so forth. Runtime Insights is actually based on a cloud-native open source tool called Falco, and we're extremely excited that uh, Falco recently graduated with the Cloud Native Computing Foundation. Uh, the Falco graduation is the testament to the importance of runtime security and how key it is to detect and react in real time uh, to protect cloud infrastructures. If you want to learn more about us, about how we can protect uh, and secure you every second, please come visit us at booth J23. I really hope to see you there.